talking. Now, I'm I'll ask the question. I will ask okay, the question and I'll shut me, up. Dude. What is your empirical methodology to show an ancestor descendant relationship between any two mineralized fossils? Okay. So I'm going to answer. I know you're going to interrupt because you don't know how to have a conversation. So I already am prepared for you to interrupt. But my point is that that is a moot point because you don't have to demonstrate that. My no, it is a moot point. Otherwise, you don't. See, know I already, that. I'm a mind reader. I'm a no, mind reader. Not, no, it's not happen. a moot point. No, All you're right, just goodbye, simply sir. saying. You're goodbye, saying. You're sir. saying. What goodbye, you're saying sir. is what you're saying. Okay, what he just did. Okay, he just took a stick of dynamite, blew the conversation up because he couldn't answer the question. He tried to say that it was a moot point. It's not a moot point. If you can't demonstrate that there's an ancestor descendant relationship between mineralized fossils, then the anatomy and and the anatomy that we see that's represented in the fossil record does not necessarily indicate an arrival of new complex genetic information. It's begging the question. So what he was doing was when he says we can see the arrival of new genetic information because we see a different uh, uh, animal forms in the fossil record, that's begging the question. He was literally committing circular reasoning. Darth, can I uh, ask you something? Sure. Okay, so earlier you said something about uh, uh, like natural selection being unable to explain this like uh, gargantuan arrival of hierarchical information. I forgot what exactly your wording was, but you, I'm pretty sure you, you used the, 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 the wording hierarchical information. Can you explain what, what, what you mean by that? Yeah, if, if, we, if we were to take a look at the, let's say the human genome, what we have, we have genetic sequences for complex anatomy and physiology, and the arrangement is also hierarchical. Okay, it also, for example, in the in the in the 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 coding sequence in the genome has to allow not just for basic cellular reproduction; it has to do with embryological development from the, from the when from the you have to go from the first cell to a zygote to various fetal stages to the time you become a toddler to the time you become a child, a teenager, and then finally an, an adult. All of that is going to require a hierarchy of information. This is a totally uncontroversial statement. The point is simply this, is that people have been duped by a very sophisticated just-so story about evolution. Almost all of it is a just-so story. It has nothing to do with observation. But because it sounds good and it sounds convincing, people believe it. Now, when we talk about natural selection, all natural selection means is that each new offspring when when it grows to to maturity, okay, Dark Dawkins, because, because of it, be, hold on a second, because of it, Sorry. because of the because of the genotype and the phenotype, okay, it has certain features that may be more fit to live in environment than another organism, and it lives another day to to reproduce, okay, to reproduce its kind. That natural selection with that respect does not give an account for the arrival of new genetic information random mutations does not account for new complex genetic information and neither do beneficial mutations because the beneficial mutations that we actually have observed and documented are simply mutations which are pretty much losses of genetic information okay if you for example if you add one nucleotide to a nucleotide sequence. When you add a nucleotide by a mutation, okay, that's a loss of the previous state of information. Okay. How, now, how is it a loss? I'm not done. Added? I'm not. Don't over talk me. You see, over talking yeah, me know. doesn't work. I'm talking. I'll like wait. Wait till I'm you done. Wait till talking, I'm done. Man. You can shut the fuck up until wait till I'm done. That's because okay? you talk for five Okay. Hours. You can shut the fuck up. All right. I'm gonna turn. Shut you up. Okay. Let's let Dar speak. Okay. All right. I turned him down. Now. I will, I will finish what I'm saying and then I will shut up and he can offer his objection. Now, when we observe beneficial mutations, what occurs is we generally have a very tiny, small mutation like a point mutation, okay, or even in rare instances, a frame shift, okay, which will allow for a novel effect 
that produces some type of advantage to survivability. Case in point, certain microorganisms will have a point mutation resulting in their ability to digest something that they couldn't before, but the biochemical pathways and coding sequences for digestion are already there. So they're able to digest some things where other things they can't because of the nucleotide sequencing. But because of the mutation, they can now digest something that, that they couldn't before. This is not all new biochemical pathways for all new complex anatomy and physiology that didn't exist before. So when you go from a microorganism all the way to the human gene, Genome, you literally have a gargantuan amount of complex genetic information that must arrive. Simply invoking natural selection does not account for it. Neither does beneficial mutations account for this. Okay. Are you done? Hello? Are you done? Are you finished? I am, I am done. Okay, great. Thank you. So this is completely and objectively incorrect on pretty much every single level. Uh, First of all, how does it feel to have been absolutely destroyed from uh, from uh, destiny? First of all, second of all, that's a non sequitur, stop. ladies and gentlemen. Oh no, I'm just doing it to make fun of you because I think you're an that's absolutely a, that, hilarious. That's a non sequitur. Okay, great, it's great. No, it's no, it's no. I'm trying to talk. Stay don't don't, don't bulldoze me, man. Don't bulldoze me. Okay, Stick second. to the topic, snowballs. <laughs> okay, second so, of all, please just stay on topic, please. You won't okay, get anywhere okay, if you just okay. fucking try to. Second of all, it like is that. a. Okay, there are various ways in which mutation happens, okay, in the genetic code. Some of them involve things like deletion, where there is a loss of genetic code. However, I've, I've already them, agreed to that. Right. Some of them are the copying of genetic code or the adding of random ones in the genetic sequence. Yeah, I'm, I'm, familiar, I'm, familiar with, I'm familiar with gene duplication. That doesn't solve the problem. No, it does. Well, it is an increase in genetic information, whether you want to no, admit no, it or not. No, 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 you're not. No, you're not. Yes, if it I, is. Listen, it's objectively let me, an increase. Let me let me explain. Let me explain. To, let hold me explain on, to you. If I if I have a poem, two, if I listen one, to me, if three, I have a poem, if I have a poem, no, you what you're not. You see, you, you're, you're so dumb. This, this is oh ridiculous. Oh my god! I yeah, I bro. Dumb. If I have listen to me, listen to me. No, you don't let me finish. If I have. Listen to me. If I have, this is what happens have, when you confront some people. Have, this is what happens I, when you confront you them. Shut up! Just let him talk. Holy if shit! I, if if I have a, if I have a genetic if I have a gene for a tail on a polywog and it duplicates, that does not account for the arrival of complex anatomy that that did not exist before. Duplicating a gene for a finger does not account for the genes of a kidney or of of a, a of a brain. OK, so there there is no dispute. Creationists and ID advocates such as myself do not dispute that in rare instances there might be gene duplication. But the fact of the matter is gene duplication in and of itself, even if it were to happen on, on numerous instances, it wouldn't account for the complex anatomy of stuff like your brain or your or your spinal column. Okay. That's your opinion, and it's wrong. You're saying you're saying that over the course of billions of years. How how that, is it wrong? How is it wrong? You're saying over the you're saying over billions of years the increase of genetic information, which you didn't even admit you were wrong about that there is that there can be an increase, not just decrease, but the increase you're just of you're just repeating your initial claim. The increase of genetic information can't eventually come to something like a brain. That's okay. Do you think? Okay. Do you th do you think That's it's mathematically it. okay? Do you think it's mathematically probable? Do I think it's mathematically probable? Sure, it's mathematically probable. Okay, can you there explain to me? Can you can you explain like to me? No, the reason. No, you see, you, that, that's another begging the question. The only reason why you believe that it's probable that they're aliens is because you already believe in the probabilistic occurrence of evolution, which you haven't established yet. No, evolution has completely been established. You're no, 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 sir. It. Okay, oh, I'll ask you. Totally very, okay, listen, ideas. listen, everybody. Here comes the coup de gras. You guys, know what the coup de gras is? Yes, the finishing blow. Okay, no, here's the, here's, here, here it comes. Here. Are you ready? Are you ready, <laughs> Mr. Arrogant One? Guess what? You're going to get your head chopped off, and you don't oh even see it. He, don't, no, he dodges the, he dodges the slice and stabs you in the chest. Okay, here we go. Are you ready? Hold you on. said it. You, I you wasn't said, finished with I'm my trying to have a conversation with you. I was you no, said, it, you my... said it was established. Stop. I'm going to ask Stop. you a question. Stop. Are all conclusions in science provisional? 
What exactly do you mean when you say provisional? You don't understand that question? What does it mean to say provisional? Oh, gee, gee, easy. Holy son. shit, okay. you literally okay. can't. In, 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 the philosophy, in the philosophy of science, this is a very uh, foundational concept. Are all conclusions in science provisional, yes or no? What does provisional mean? Jesus. It, it means it can be changed. It means it can be changed. It means today we might accept it, but tomorrow it could turn out to be entirely false. Sure. So that's your best Good. evidence. Therefore, that evolution is therefore, not true. just therefore, it's if a it's conclusion, still the best if it, okay, f okay, fuck off, you little troll. I'm going to turn you down now. Okay, right. sir, Snowy. If yes. you say that something has been established, do you mean that it's been verified? Something has been established versus verified. If it's established, okay, is it sta there is sta is listen to me. Is hold on, I'm trying to answer. I'm listen. Instead of talking like a hyper teenager, oh I'm God. listen, dude. I'm in my fifties. Okay. Your yes, no, you're, you're not. Fucker. You're being an yes, asshole. Yes, I am. I'm not I'm being an asshole. I'm trying out. to respond. I'm Just trying listen. to have a conversation with you, and I'm See, not going to no, buck under to a fast talking teenager. Now I'm going to ask you a question. I'm not a fast talking teenager. I'm a fast talking young adult. Isn't there? Well, you're not, you're not acting like an adult. No. What do you mean, okay. acting like an adult? Um, you're acting no. Oh, my God. Now, you're not Snowy. responding, and you interrupt Now, Snowy, me. I'm trying to have a conversation <laughs> with you. And Quit I'm talking over people, not, Darth. I'm not, not, not going to buckle under to your fast talking. Quit now, talking over know, people, Darth. People is, is, garbage. Is, you got to let it finish. Is, okay. I'm asking Snowy, you a question. Quit talking over people, Darth. You guys talk over people. I tried responding, and he talked over people. Listen, you guys can keep on trolling. Listen, quit. Quit talking over people, Darth, okay? <laughs> okay, good. Now I just muted Skinny Pete. Now, Snowy, now, when when you say it's been established, do you mean by Quit talking over people, or Darth. You actually let me respond in the first place. I will now get back I to I want an answer to that question. Is something established in science? Darth Dawkins, you cannot mute on this server. You cannot mute on this server. And then on to the question you Okay, I, I asked my question. I will ignore anything you say unless you answer the question. You literally Quit talking asked over me a question. I started to respond, and then you instantly okay. I will like, interrupted you, uh, me. I and asked the question. Oh, the I asked the question. Anything oh. you say, I will ignore if you don't answer the question. <laughs> How about you ignore it? Because it's How about I ask you a question? When you say when you say it's been scientifically established, is it verified, or you mean it's established by consensus? Okay, when I say something's scientifically verified, it means there is an increased amount of- there is I didn't ask you that question. That's not an answer to my question, sir. Do you need me to repeat the question? I said, when you said that, that something was scientifically established, do you mean that it has been verified that it is true or that it's been established because it is agreed upon by consensus? It is established by the evidence. That's not an answer to my question, sir. Yes, it is. Is establishing mean that it is verified to be true or that it is simply accepted because of consensus? Nothing is verified to be true in science. Things are more or less thank likely to be true based on the you. evidence. Thank you. Thank so, you. So when you say that something, so when, so, so when you say that it is established, that it's not verified, right? Mm -hmm. What exactly, like verified as in like proving to be okay. true without well, a shadow said, of a doubt? So, so when you say that something has been established, you mean that it has not been verified Sir. to be true. It's just uh, accepted by uh, consensus. Your best nothing is, all, is, that nothing not is verified to be true. true. You can't know with one hundred percent Excellent. Anything. Good. Then nothing you say about science, science has been verified to be true then. And nothing you say about religion is verified to be true. I, that's a non sequitur, well, sir. We're not discussing, we're though. not discussing that. We're not discussing that. And another non non sequitur because you're basically trying to say you why do you okay why is it but listen, you somehow know god's real just do, do i didn't mention god in this conversation at all to you so do you have trouble focusing and concentrating <laughs> on the topic no i'm just an internet troll well it sure sounds that way <laughs> It's because, Darth. okay, hold on. I'm going to explain a little bit about Darth Dawkins here and the psychology behind him. You are the Jeez. type of person who loves- So you're not going to make an argument. A person like myself. Don't interrupt. You are, you Why very, you very, very much love Why playing these types of games to basically try and discredit science. And the ultimate conclusion you go I'm not to- discredit, I'm not discrediting not science. Not oh, he's trying to discredit science when he can't prove question. religion. I'm questioning Even if you like, grant him the argument, it doesn't prove religion. Science, but it's got way more no. evidence than- yeah, 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 sir. See, how does your worldview provide for evidence, sir? What, 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 what has to be true in order for there to be evidence? Uh, how through novel work? testable predictions, which work in the Snowy? molly. What has balloon. to be true for? What has to be true first for there to be evidence? 
what has to be true first, the ability yeah. for us to understand the world around us and to be able to make okay, predictions well that, about that, it. That, that's not, no, that you didn't, you didn't understand the question. Okay. okay. Um, does, do, okay. You're not understanding the question, right? Okay. Now, I'm listening. You, you say your worldview provides for evidence. Now, right. does evidence require the precondition that there are causal connections between events? This isn't a fucking are, interview. Yes, Answer some goddamn questions, people. Darth. Okay. There are Do you, okay. Okay. Sure. All right. So, so causal connections between events is a necessary precondition for evidence. Quit letting this jack right? off ask all the questions. I know. Steve, right? shut well, up. That's what Darth does. He only wants to answer. He okay. only no, asks no, me. You, you said there's evidence. evidence. I want to see. I, listen. You said there's evidence in your worldview. I want to see. Don't if answer that holds his questions. Water. Is that? Can I see if it Wasn't holds the water with you? discussion about evolution. Well, now, I mean, okay. you can go now, research. I want to see. I want to see. I want to see if you can if you can defend that evidence is a viable What's evidence in his in world worldview. Now, I, what I'm going to ask you is, please don't I, listen. I'll just keep on talking. His until I get done with my question. Now, if I have to kill my sound, I will. Now, in your worldview, ev you just stated that evidence requires that there be causal connections between uh, between events in order for there to be evidence. Now, relatively, I will, I, okay. Listen to me. I I'm not done. Shut the fuck up. 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 Okay. All right. All right. Okay. Everyone, just calm down for a second. We're gonna do one at a time. Good. Uh, the hold on. Hey, 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 guys, guys, guys. I still hear multiple people talking. I'm literally mute people. I mean, this doesn't happen in my room. Mute everybody. It, well, it bulldoze and silence anyone who this does not happen. Guys, 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 guys. Well, what's easiest is just to just to have everyone be quiet and go just one at a time before line. I don't interrupt. Don't interrupt. It's all good. I'll mute people if I need to mute people. I don't need Please to mute do. people yet. I well, don't need make to. this guy answer some questions. This is an interview. Darth yeah, well, wants this, to conduct this interviews. This clusterfuck keeps going on. This doesn't happen in my room. Ever. It's true. Uh, <laughs> okay, oh, now, Snowy, so Snowy, now, 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 Snowy, here's the question, yeah. and I'll shut up, okay? You want to maintain that evidence is a viable concept in your non-Christian sure. worldview. You said that evidence requires that there, there are causal connections between events. Now, can okay. you give me a rational justification that there are indeed causal connections between events that does not presuppose causality such as sense perception? I'm sorry, what? Like, okay, you have to somewhat trust in your perceptions, yes, but like, it's more likely that your perceptions are going to be true than not. Not an answer to my question. Okay. Okay, I asked for a rational justification that there are indeed causal connections. Between no, you did events. answer his question. It does not appeal to something that presupposes causal connections such as sense perception. Do you or have a rational mind. justification? So you cannot use your mind as well. I I'm already told any... you that justification is that we have to make some level of assumption that we can A, understand okay. our world, and B, That's be not an answer to... to my question. It is an answer to your question. You just don't Sir? like the answer uh, because what you is probably the justification? Can't what is the justification point. for causal connections? What is the justification for causal connections? Yes. To some degree, you do have to presuppose it. So you I don't have one? The case. So, you, so you don't have one? It's an answer, and he doesn't like it. Exactly. That is what is going on. Okay, you did, everybody, like did everybody hear that? So you don't I have did. a rational justification no, for causal have, connections? I don't like the answer. Now, I'm going to what, ask you a question. The what I'm is going the to ask you a question. I already the answered this. Oh, I already no, you didn't. Oh, no. Oh, Yes, I you didn't right. give me one. You, you don't like the answer. This That's is why awesome. it is impossible no, to talk no, with you because you have the mind no, of a teenager. No, Dude, priority you speaker. Have priority you speaker. You literally have asked me like I'm thirty questions. Phone. Refuse to let me. Like we'll keep going whenever you don't. I'll like be the glad answer, to take your question. question. I'll be glad Make to this answer your fucker question. Answer some questions. Answer. Okay, I'm going to ask you a question. Is saying that you assume. Okay, I will be glad. Okay, listen, dude. I'll be glad to answer any of your questions that you put to me. But you said that you assume. You said you assume causal connections. Is that is is you is the are is the assuming that there are causal connections? Is there? You see, you're you, you know what? You're just like a hysterical woman at that Could time of the month. You just don't show look up. at him. He's just asking more questions. Right? He won't answer now, anything. My question to I'm you is you question, my question dark. to you no, is you see, no, you're just throwing a stick of dynamite into the conversation. Please stop. Please stop. Okay, can I just butt in here, Duncan? I mean, sorry, Darth. 
Snowy obviously asked you a question, but every time he asks you a question, you just try to divert it with another question. No, 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 no. Are, you, are you a mod? Are you a mod? It doesn't uh, matter. Uh, okay, I'm not, a, I'm not an authority, so don't listen to me. Okay, good. Then, then I'm not going to listen to you. Unless you're a mod, I'm not going to listen to you. I, Nobody I answered Darth's question. No, I'm a mod. I'm a mod. Okay, okay. Don't me, look at my name. Darth I'm a mod. Dawkins, I am asking okay, fine. You okay, so you're, so you're a mod. Now, I asked him a question, and he said he assumes that there are causal connections, and he says assuming is a rational I, justification. That's no, a contradiction that in terms. No, I there's a more likely possibility that, we, that it is true than it is not, and there's a lot of reasons for that, but I'm asking you the questions it, it, now, okay. so shut okay. up. Okay, <laughs> that, that's, not a, that's, not a, that's not a rational it, justification that there are causal what? connections. What? <laughs> rational? He's just Some asking you a question. Make what Darth can't answer. answer? Okay, okay. Darth. What rational justification do you have that your worldview is true? That that Jesus is okay. The rational justification is is called a reductio ad absurdum. Do you know what that is? No, no, that's no, talking I about don't... your argument. Okay. That's, that's not a fucking argument. definition a of his. Reductio ad absurdum in, in philosophy. There are different ways of reasoning th for things. You can reason inductively. You can reason deductively. You can reason abductively. Okay. okay. If you reason if you reason inductively or discrediting somebody else's argument not is not information for your. Now, if you reason deductively, it can be logically necessary. That? Now, if you reason through a reductio ad absurdum, it's an indirect form of reasoning where you present the proposition, and the way that you establish the proposition is that the denial of the proposition leads to contradiction and absurdity, thereby affirming the proposition. Now, I'll ask you a simple question before I go on. Is a reductio ad absurdum a legitimate form of, of reasoning in philosophy? Okay. I'm sorry. That doesn't you... make his position valid. Is a reductio yeah, ad absurdum a legitimate form of reasoning? No, not that. Can you re-explain, re please, a reductio ad absurdum? A reductio ad absurdum is you present the proposition and that the proposition is true due to the its denial leading to a contradiction or absurdity. Sure. It's to reduce that... an argument okay, to absurdity, now, and it does not sure. make his believe, argument any more in valid. You the external physical world due to the impossibility of its negation, right. meaning everything would be incoherent and absurd, right? Mm, to some degree, sure. No, no, not no, to, because not we to have a working degree, model. No, entire. the answer is no. Okay. Now, so you ask me, can I, how do how do I defend the Christian worldview? Well, through a reductio ad absurdum, that the denial of the existence of the Christian God and His property set will mean mm -hmm. that you will not be able to establish the explanation and intelligibility of dependent facts because you will not be able to identify what the ultimacy of reality is that provides for dependent We have a facts. working so empirical model. We don't need God, ultimacy. So I'm, I'm not, you ask me a question, I'm explaining a concept to you. Okay? Well, it's what he said is the I'm not, I'm trying, I'm trying to explain model. something to you. Listen, you see, no wonder you're a Destiny supporter because Holy you're just shit. a mo you're just a motor mouth like, like Destiny is now. He doesn't I, answer questions. He just wants to try to discredit okay, your on argument. A second. I'm going to establish. He just wants to try to discredit to your argument. You, you know, are you sure you're not? Guys, are you sure you're not a tranny because you sure argue like Holy a what kind of argument? Okay. Somebody yeah. mute my fucking Darth. Do you do you do you deny? Do you yeah, deny? Do you deny the proposition? Do you deny he's the running proposition? A, he's running a with Don't you. answer you his question. Do you deny questions. the proposition oh. that the Christian God and His property set are the necessary precondition for all intelligible facts? Do you deny uh, that? Yes, I do. Because that's okay. Good. Right. Good. Okay. Fine. Fine. So now we're going to test out the reductio ad absurdum. We can that run the, the denial reductio of the proposition to leads to uh, absurdity. Now, could you please tell me then, when you assert any or all dependent facts? What do they ultimately depend upon? And in the absence of you telling me of what they ultimately depend upon, you will not have intelligibility for dependent facts. So what is the ultimacy of reality that is the basis and origin point for all dependent facts? Dependent facts, the ability, the the complete assumption that we have the ability to both <clears throat> recognize what exists in our world and what yeah, we, well, you didn't understand the question. Wow, that was it. That was that was really you embarrassing. You just said assumption. You listen oh to me. You God. didn't understand the question, and the question was very clear. Since you reject that the Christian God, listen the carefully, Motor Mouth. Listen, to, just listen, don't like listen, answer. listen. No, what I don't like is somebody uh, screeching at me like. Do not let this woman. bitch now, talk over you. I, you didn't Dominate address him. the question. Maybe because you didn't understand it. Now, since you reject the Christian God as the absolute and ultimacy of reality that provides for all dependent facts, what I want to know is. What is it that ultimately it exists that question? is non-dependent and Quit letting him talk that is over the basis and origin point for all dependent does. facts? What is the answer, sir? 
The answer Make him answer. No, don't answer. answer. Make him answer. The answer is very Why simple. We do we have need to, to firstly the demonstrate that. Would you shut up and let Snowy talk, please? Okay, you're basically asking what can. We... I'm, I'm sorry. Like, because. Quit because playing his fucking is... game. Bro, bro Nuff is a goofball, like, dog. Don't you play with Shut up. You know what? You know what? Hey, you know, if there's any mods in the room, this, this clusterfuck does not happen in my room. <laughs> Okay. That's because I'm going to go to your room. Snowy, I'm coming. Snowy, I'm coming, Snowy, I'm coming to your defense because okay. these guys are over talking you. All right, no, sure. they're not. So, they're over talking so, you. You're a goofball dog. Please go to your room. Why you Don't answer control. Darth's question. Okay, I will ignore anyone else but Snowy right now. Ooh, you're wasting then, like, your time you talking to me. Go back to your room and go have your power trip over there. I'm not. Okay, good. I'm now muting you, Issy. I now know Ooh, that you're. Bro, you can't Ooh. mute people on this server, no, dog. You can't. I, I'm good, a I'll, good. I'll turn you down to 1%, fag. Why the That's fuck are you muting me? Wow. I'm not even the one talking. Answer the question. Wait, wait, wait. Darth just used fag. Somebody get that too much. Darth just called somebody a fag. Get that to a mod. Or <laughs> just violated terms of service. Just please. violate terms of service. Get to the mod. Yo, Snowy, 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 Snowy. Yo, Gary. Yo, Gary. Snowy, I'm waiting, for, I'm, waiting for an an, I'm waiting for an answer. Yo, take him. This guy's name is Gary. This guy's okay, like that. Fucking I just, I just turned down trial. another troll. So, Think Snowy, that's... can you tell me what is what is the absolute of existence? Snowy. What you is don't the need one. Of existence? You need Since to not the Christian God, God, what is it? Well what then, if you the nothing, then, nothing, then 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 if you say there's nothing absolute, then your dependent facts don't depend upon there's anything. Absolute, there's Please demonstrate that. Okay, you, you don't realize. Listen no. to me. You real. You don't realize. Just ask him how you to demonstrate to why you need that. Snowy, I know you are. I'm trying to have a conversation with you. Listen, Snowy, you don't realize. You don't realize what you just said. You did what you just said was you, you It doesn't matter. He said there are no absolutes. Darth, I didn't go. say okay, there are no say, absolutes. Okay. Would you actually if there aren't okay, any okay, absolutes. Okay, here's the question. What is it that is absolute, Snowy? Is, what is absolute? Hold on. You said what is the absolute of existence? That's very different. The absolute of existence is we cannot possibly know because it's outside Excellent. Of our Thank you. He fell for the bait, ladies and oh, gentlemen. Oh, yeah. Of course I fell for the bait. But the problem hey. is that you can't know either, so you just assume it's okay, that's a two Quo quay fallacy you just committed. No, no it's actually reductive. You're you're okay. now, now, so in other words, so what you're saying it's is that my problem is okay. Okay, when you stated that I have the same problem that you have, is that is that I can't know anything like you? Well, no, no, we can't it, know anything outside of our universe because no, 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 no. Okay, wow. Okay, Maybe no one, no wonder, no, no, no wonder you're a limp wristed follower of destiny. You just don't realize <laughs> right. the incongruity of what you just said. Ad hom. Ad hom. The, the issue oh, is this. Which, listen to me. Listen, ad hom. Listen to me. Why don't you say? Why don't you, why don't you say? Why don't you say that the absolute of existence is not known? Then you have no basis for stating dependent facts. Do you realize how catastrophic that is? Okay, all right. No, you're not understanding. Let me explain it to you. Are you familiar with the law of excluded middle? Do you know what the law of excluded middle is? I'm not. I am not okay, here. the law of excluded middle is. Don't is answer this bitch's question. You don't, you don't, you don't answer it. Snowy, don't listen to the dog. This is what a, this is what a cluster oh, fuck. I'm sure we have a mod in here, and they're doing nothing to stop to stop it. Bro, but dog, you said the f word, bro. The mods let you say the f word. Hold hold on a second. Okay. Yeah. Got recorded for saying the f word. I am trying to listen to Darth. Okay, now Snowy. Yes. With Everybody lobby. report what Darth. You know what I'm just gonna do? No, this mod's going next around, time, oh, Okay, I'm gonna, I'm, gonna, I'm, gonna, I'm, I'm, okay, I'm gonna have to kill my sound here because we have people just non-stop trying to listen to this, because the mods are so Listen to this You just said the F word. I should mute you. Okay, so Snowy, I can't hear anyone talking in the mic right now. Okay, now. Okay, how about this, Darth? How about this? Add me and then we will have a conversation. X no, no, no. Make him ask their question. Now, when we plug bro, in the Bro, Killjoy, what are you doing, fact, bro? A fact is either dependent or not dependent. Do you understand that? Shut the I fuck up, on? Darth. Okay, a fact is either dependent or not dependent. That's all I was able to hear. Okay, do you accept that? That that statement is necessarily true. Do you accept it? Dependent or not Okay, dependent. before we even continue with that, you guys need to learn how to fucking behave, okay? Next person who says anything they shouldn't be saying is getting muted for 30 minutes, and I promise you, I will forget.
Why isn't hey, Darth being muted okay, now? So, Snowy, do you understand that a f any fact, any spoken fact, mm -hmm. will either be dependent or non-dependent? Do you accept that? Sure, dependent on something, okay. yes. That, that's right. All right. So in 99.9% .9 of the things that we say, we're invoking facts that are dependencies and their existence, their viability, and their intelligibility as fact is going to only be in virtue of what they ultimately depend upon. Now, before I continue, do you accept that? I'm sorry. Can you repeat it? I'm... Whenever, we, whenever we invoke dependent facts, they will only be viable and intelligible with respect to what they ultimately depend upon. Do you accept that? Okay. Accept. Now, when it comes to the, with, I told you that I would give you the proof of the Christian worldview via a reductio ad absurdum. So I am presenting the Christian God and his attributes, which are the necessary preconditions for all intelligibility of dependent, excuse me, dependent facts. Now, when you, re when you reject that, then when you invoke any or all facts that are dependencies, all right, then what you're going to have to tell me for their viability and intelligibility of what they ultimately depend upon. Now, in the absence of you telling me what they ultimately depend upon, then your facts are vacuous and they're, they're unintelligible. Okay, but I know what do you want, Okay, hold on a second. Do you accept that last statement? No. No, I do not. Okay. Hold okay. On. Then we're going to have to go explain. over it again because it, it's explain. just a restating. Shut up. I am talking. It, because not accepting it is a because violation. You Listen to me. me. What it not accept. I, I have to explain to you your error. Not oh, accepting it is a is a violation. Is a violation of the law of excluded middle. Oh, okay. Ask them, ask them what the argument for that is. You What's just, the argument? You just violated. You just I'm not violated. Violating the law of Darth, Darth. Darth. I'm going to ask you one more time. You've got to let him talk. Wait, wait. Okay. So what's the argument? What it depends it on is it de – okay, you're saying it depends on God. I am Personally. saying it No, depends. I didn't say that. You're not listening. Okay, that's, that's not fine. what I said. It, I don't know what it you're depends on. You're not listening. Here's, hold on. I don't know what it depends on. That's fine. Here is what I am saying it depends on. It depends that the rules of our universe are predictable. <laughs> okay, you're not understanding. By this. nature, that I you're have not the assumption the that the rules don't. outside Dude, of the universe are listen to are me. Also listen predictable. to me. You're not understanding what I just said to you. You're interrupts. just rambling. You true. Listen to me. I'm not rambling. I'm, I'm not trying. Listen, I'm like not appealing. Plan. Listen, I'm not playing to the room. I'm going to tell you right now. Okay. I'm in my late fifties. I'm not going to lie to you. You don't understand what I just said to you. Okay. I I'm not interested in appealing to other like teenagers. Nature, did, I'm common. trying to, I'm trying to explain to you your mistake. Okay. Now the law of excluded middle. Okay. Applies to f dependent facts. Now, if if you if you invoke any dependent fact, then it doesn't matter what it is. If mm -hmm. I say to you, uh, if if you say an apple on the counter, okay, or a dog wagging its tail, doesn't matter what the fact is. Sure. If if you say here is a dependent fact, and I say what does it ultimately depend upon? If you say that it does not ultimately depend upon anything, or that that which is ultimate that it depends upon is unidentifiable, then what you have presented when you assert a dependent fact is an unintelligible fact because it doesn't depend upon anything. A dependent fact that doesn't depend upon anything is by default an unintelligible fact. Do you understand? I did already. Yeah, I know. And I've answered your question. It depends. Okay. You're not, you're not, on. you're not what understanding is the other, this. Hold on. The other person wants to say something, so I'm going to respond. I'm going to yeah, let him you're, respond. You're, 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 you're a clueless teenager. That's I'm why not a clueless understand. teenager. You don't like my response because you want me to say it's dependent on my oh, senses. Oh, you did not, you so didn't you understand. Down bullshit road. You, th you think that you can have an, you think, you think, you no, think I, that you can have intelligibility for you dependent you facts me, that don't depend you upon want anything. You to say it is dependent on our senses because, so you can go down. Guys. Well, what you should do is you should ban anyone else from talking except for me and Snowy. Then the problem will be solved. I don't have this no, problem in my that's, mind. that's not how this works. I don't no. have, yeah, well, you can do it temporarily so so other people are just trolling. I don't have this problem in Nobody my Nobody here is trolling. 
That's not my point. That's not my point. You problem because you uh, mute anyone who proves you wrong. Or uh, and you know what? Question. And you know, Big Chaser, the trolling has been going on for an hour and no mods are doing anything. We definitely just muted half the room for you. So, yeah. Thank you. Yeah. About time. Well, I, I did that. I was going to ask you, Darth. I've been waiting to ask you. Did you call someone a banned word? Yes. I, I, I might have I by accident. Uh, I, I don't care if it's by accident. It doesn't justify it, yeah. Anyway, so the, the bottom line is... The... No, no. I'm not, I'm, not ta yeah. I'm not talking to you. You're a fucking troll, Vive. You can go to hell. No, that's the, bye, bye. that's the rules, dude. Uh, yeah, I just mute, I just muted you, Vive. I'm not talking to you. You can mute bye. bod. You mute a mod in a channel where you have no power. Okay, that was Can we go to oh, the shit. other room? Yeah. Well, early, uh, not earlier, but like I think it was like two days ago, you said that the Bible doesn't make sense. Do you still stand by that? I'm still interpreting. Hey, I'm what's going on, guys? This is a whack out. mod. And it's my like, understanding that, and I'm not trying to think. Can I the finish mods real quick? act like oh, power yeah. hungry. So I'm still interpreting. Like hungry I'm to take trying down, to do research. Um, I'm trying yeah, to look that things was up. Terrible, bro. It's just that These some awful, things I think I need what a little happened? help on. What just happened? They were trolling the crap out of them know. in the other room. I mean, it's a massive piece. It's a package deal, right? What? It's a package deal. Oh. What do you I mean? had a question it's for a Dark. Okay, okay, listen, everybody yeah. shut up. I'm just yeah. muting people now for the people over talking me. Okay? Oh, I know. The, the whole room was a complete well, cluster fuck because the mods don't give a yeah. shit. Mm -hmm. say that, say it's that, that simple. Say that again. Okay? And then Veeb comes like in and starts just trolling yeah. again. Yeah, could you repeat that? Right? This thing. crap doesn't happen in my room. The Bible's not free. Okay? And so the and the whole cluster fuster was going on for one hour. Meanwhile, the mods are just sitting by doing nothing because that's what they want to happen. Okay, you're unmuted. Sir. What's in the box? You're unmuted. Unmuted. So go ahead. Yeah, they were just trolling. It was terrible. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Many of the mods are absolutely terrible, and uh, Doobie doesn't do crap about it. That's why I need the room. It's because the mod the mods would regularly come in here, troll me. They allow trolling in the in the other room. And you want to know what? We have lots of productive conversations in here. Whereas in the other rooms, what happens is is the Jacobins come out of the woodwork and they they verbally assassinate. They they're verbally violent so that there can't be conversation go on as to so they can they can white knight. Uh, for somebody like like that guy who didn't know what the hell he was talking about happens every single time, and most of the mods are absolute losers. So why don't you leave? Um, I I I, I finally did leave when 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 Vive was uh, doing his usual trolling again. That's why I came into here because as you as you'll notice, the room is packed, and we simply no, no, do no, not we do it. not have shut the fuck up. I'm talking. Oh, I mean, okay. Okay. But I'm okay. Bye, 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 bye. There we go. See, no more interruptions. You see, because I don't, I don't tolerate this crap. The mods in the other room do. That's why my room is packed out all the time, and people like listening to it. It's, it's instead of that circus that was up there. That's because most of the mods are complete losers. And then they were trying to get you to apologize to someone. Yeah, uh, I know the guy. The guy that Darth called the uh, the f word was a is a notorious troll. Like not even like he's just literally a troll. And yeah, uh, he, he's not yeah. even allowed. To yeah, and I, I I had him I had him cor I had him cornered, and all he could do was respond to me like a hysterical woman on her period. I mean, that's how bad this guy was. <laughs> And you were trying right. to like defend him almost because they weren't letting him talk, and then he still. Well, was I did. Little... I I did come to his defense because I wanted to finish the humiliation of his just his other stupidity. And the funny thing is, even after I explained the question to him that even a, a fifth grader could understand, he still didn't understand it. He's just a motor mouth. And by the way, he he played. He, listen, he showed his cards right from the beginning because he's a Destiny fan. Oh, what a loser. I don't you know, know how you could like Death Tiny. Wait, oh, that's funny, bad. dude. Nice meme. Death, Destiny it's not a meme, it's facts. Oh, I bet this SWR guy's a Destiny supporter, too.
What's it this tiny? No, I just don't like how people just keep using that same meme. So oh, boring, okay. Well, I could call him a pedophile, but that'd be a fact, not a meme. No, that's a fact. Yeah. So, so what what happens is is I get these young skulls full of mush. They decide that they want to take me on, and then when I try to interact with them, they're just nonstop motor mouths. And the guy doesn't know what he's talking about. I mean, the guy the guy was stupidly trying to argue that gene duplication can account for the hierarchical increase of complex genetic information that we find in the human genome, all the way from a microorganism. I mean, that is laughable. Absolutely ha laughable. How do you have gene duplication from the genes that are in a microorganism that that are going to result in uh, the coding sequences for brains or pancreases? I mean, it's it's ridiculous. It's one thing is if 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 a creature has a digit, like a phalange of a finger, and it has a gene duplication, and there are two phalanges or or fingers. Okay, but that's not what we're talking about. We're talking about the arrival of complex um, genetic information for all new complex anatomy and physiology that never existed before. Basically, how do you, how do you, how, yeah, I mean, it's just, it's just, I mean, these people are shooting their mouths off. They don't know what they're talking about. So they're basically, he's basically thinking that uh, when we see examples of duplication or mutations that are duplicates, and it's the same information duplicated, he thinks that proves uh, an increase of new information. It's it's not new. It's not information any more than if I slap the poem "Mary Had a Little Lamb" on a photocopier and I duplicate it. That's not new information. That's just a duplication of what was already there. No, no, that's what I mean. But he thinks that that proves somehow that you can get right. new information from. Yeah, patient. I know, I know. See, they, they, they see they've been they've been brainwashed to believe. That, that that natural selection is what what provides for evolution but the natural selection that they're talking about is presupposing the arrival of very complex anatomy and um, uh, anatomy and physiology that would need to arrive on the scene when you go from the microorganism from a microorganism to the hu human genome okay uh, beneficial mutations cannot account for that Beneficial mutations are simply novel effects on pre-existing genetic code that might provide for a slight increase of fitness. It doesn't, it doesn't account for the arrival of anatomy and physiology like of complex brains. I mean, it's just ridiculous. They've been so brainwashed since the time they were children and because evolution is dogma in most academic institutions th throughout throughout the world that they think that these really really smart people and because it's in books that it therefore can't be wrong i mean this is the same people that go oh you want me to believe the bible because it's in a book well just because somebody says we evolved through through mutations over billions of years just because it's in a book that means it's true okay and then he thought then he was trying to argue that on probabilistic grounds it could happen i mean he couldn't be more ignorant random mutations building the genome even allowing for 13.7 billion years, and even if you factor in a trillion trillion Earths, there's not enough time for mutations to probabilistically create the human genome. It's just, it's simply off the charts. Now, if, if, if you reject that, then you have to believe that something like that astronomically remote can happen. But then again, why would you believe that there is laws of nature or that there are causal relations? Because then you would, you would believe it on probabilistic grounds. So this guy flip-flops on his probabilistic reasoning. When it comes to evolution, even though it's astronomically remote, he ignores the astronomical remote, remoteness, but then he believes in, in um causal connections and laws of nature because its converse would be so uh, improbable. See, the, the, the whole atheist and, and materialist and evolutionary scenario, it's hopelessly incoherent, but they don't care because without it, they're going to have to bow the knee to God. Even Richard Dawkins said this. Richard Dawkins said this, okay? <laughs> Richard, Richard Lowenstein, an evolutionary atheist geneticist, said the same thing. And you can find his quote on the internet. He says, no matter how convoluted or far-fetched some of our so-called scientific explanations are, we're going to have to accept it. Otherwise, we're going to have to allow a divine foot in the door. Now, you'll notice in my room, there's no cross-talking going on. Gee, why is that happening? Why is why, why is that happening? Hey, hey, hey. No, That's... don't air mod grievances and stuff in, in chat. 
Yeah. It's because I, mean, I don't I don't put up with it. You get server muted if you if you're going to be obstructionistic. But in the room above for one hour, there was nonstop cross talking, nonstop, and there were mods in the room. Duncan, can you explain the middle, the excluded middle thing to the room? The law of excluded middle is that something is is either true or it's not true. Why do you get muted? Did somebody mute him? One of the, okay, hey, uh, whoever who just who just muted me? Yeah, that was me. Can I explain why, please? No, no, you may not. You're you have. Yes, I may. <laughs> I have taken yeah. your your real Darth Dawkins roll away. You mute evaded when you were muted in the other room outside of your room. Therefore, as per Doobie's recommendation, I have doubled the mute time, which is now thirty minutes. You will have to serve that thirty minutes timer starting now. What? Why would you do that? Because he evaded a mute in another room that wasn't his. He was abusing his power against uh, the contract that we had with him, or the agreement that we had with him. What are you that yes. makes absolutely no. Release sense. the contract, asshole. <laughs> It makes perfect sense. I mean, the rules are plain in there, and you, you obviously wait, gonna so be his, wait, wait. So you're gonna take away his real Darth Dawkins role, so now nobody knows he's Darth Dawkins for 30 minutes. No, I'm oh, going to take it away okay, so that he cannot unmute himself and mute evade like he did last time. Now we're not gonna talk about this. We're gonna move on, and we're gonna keep talking about whatever we're talking about, as this is just a normal mute on a normal member. So go well, just keep we, talking. How would we weird. move on when this yeah. is his room that we You're can weird, hear? Bro. Get out of here. At the it's moment, not... this is at the moment this is not his room. Weird, bro. Leave. This is a normal room. If you guys keep talking about this, then you will be muted. So, so, so you're going to threaten the other members here that actually seem going to participate. Okay. No, you can right. participate. Just stop talking about this. Don't air my. It's against the rules. If you break the rules, you'll be muted. Oh. Isn't this so, uh, it, about this? It is, it is not a good mod. Then how do you report that? Yeah, well, this you go to politics. Is, you, if if you have a if you have a mod grievance, you don't air it in in a public chat. You DM politics mod mail. It's in the rules, not politics mod mail, but in the rules. Rule six says that you don't do it in public chat. Just DM the politics mod mail bot if you have a problem with a mod. If you have a problem so with I, this decision of muting uh, Darth because he mutivated. Then you can talk to Doobie because it was his decision. You, but I just don't think. I think if it's why well, was Darth mute? You... What? Right. So we can't room. even <laughs> we can't even say that we disagree with it. Okay. That's not what I said. But we're gonna hey. we're gonna go ahead and move on. So. Can I ask why he was muted? That's exactly what you said. Uh, Grookey, just DM me. Uh, we'll do that instead of having to linger on it. Well, I'll tell you. Can but... I report you? I'd like I'd like to report you. <laughs> yeah, you, you, can, you can DM, you can DM it to politics. Yeah, mod mail, like you said. Yeah, you can DM you're politics mod You're just trying to get attention. That's all you're doing. So you got to... That's a banned word. Sorry, I had to mute you for that. Uh, that'll be 15 minutes. So we can, and, we can go ahead and move on now and start a normal conversation. Thanks. Right. Hey, guys. Right. <laughs> he keeps, he keeps deafening and undeafening himself. Bro, Ice is a weirdo. Wait, did he like? Did he like lose his mute power? Yeah. <laughs> what? Correct. But we're not talking about this. We are moving on. Okay. Okay. Yeah, that's ass. Yeah, it is ass when you say a banned word and then avoid a mute. But yeah. again. Well, he was muted. You sound like a nerd. The... Okay. Got him. Hey, do you know how we would complain about the mod? Does anybody know? How do, how do I, I don't have a problem with ice, but I don't really care. 